Old media. Yes, man. Am I the only one that just hate Matt? Hate Matt! If Matt was a girl, we wouldn't date Matt. Date Matt! It's been about 45 years since I've really had anything to do with mathematics. And it feels good! Now, mathematics, bitch, I mean, mathematics, they say it is an essential tool for survival, I think. And the relationship between me and mathematics, it was quite fine. Until the bitch decided that she wanted to change from numbers to letters. And you know when the relationship really started to go bad? High school. I walked into mathematics class one day and then everything on the blackboard looked like winding fun. Yes, miss? Where am I going? Um, miss, I think I might be in the wrong class because I'm supposed to be having math now, but I see you writing Egyptian hieroglyph on the board, so I must see wrong class, Nina. So, 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 so how much class this? Unbreak my heart. Go back to be in numbers again. And the changes never stopped there. Matama bitch started bringing in all different types of signs. Now the signs that I was used to in mathematics class was the regular plus, multiplication, division, minus. But she wanted to try new signs. Square root, cube root, infinity, Sagittarius, Capricorn. As serious things matter, our horoscope signs did start coming out math class. And it just kept getting worse. She, Matama bitch, started using words when we not even understand. Hypotenuse which I still think to this day is news about hypertension. Don't, don't judge me. Tangent. I mean, the closest word I knew to tangent was tangerine. So when the teacher asked me, Kevin, do you care to explain to the class what a tangent is? My reply would be, okay, everybody, um, a tangent is one peg of a tangerine. Thanks. And words like calculus. Now, I honestly thought calculus was the singular for calculators. And if that wasn't bad enough, mathematics wanted to bring in other men into the relationship. Every day, a new man was introduced to me. Algebra, Pythagoras theorem. What kind of name is Pythagoras, see, bitch? And where I really drew the line was when she introduced me to a Rasta man. I Sassalis. That was it. It, it just did done right this one. It, it's funny because some of the things I was taught in um math class. <laughs> this is funny. <laughs> I am yet to use. The hell you teach it to me for if I'm not gonna use it? And I know you're gonna say better be prepared than sorry. But would you equip a soldier for a war he is never going to fight? No. So why though? I mean it's not like I'm going to be walking and somebody just attacked me out of the blue with a freaking algebra equation. Hey, Boy. What is the square root of 2b minus dc equals 26? Oh, no, no problem, no problem. Where is the square root equal 26? That is equal to... Shut the f*** up. <laughs> Some of you probably love maths. I, I don't. And I don't grudge you. I do not grudge you. But if you found this funny, and if you hate maths just like, and if you understood that I was personifying maths as if it was a person, then thumbs up to you. And also thumbs up this video. Hit the share button also. And please remember to subscribe. And I want to say shout out to all the people who actually take the time to subscribe and um, share the videos and uh, leave a comment below. Appreciate that shit, man. It's your boy Kevin Too Crazy. Think it, believe it, and live to achieve it. <laughs> 